Hi everybody. So today I wanted to make a video um, to show you guys what I do for intuitive art making. So what intuitive art making is, is when um, you use art supplies to connect with your higher self. So it's like spiritual art. And um, your higher self is you, but you're in the higher dimensions, like sixth density. So that higher self knows everything about you. It knows your past, it knows the future, it knows exactly how you're feeling, what you're thinking. And you know, like you can connect with this, with this energy um, through different ways, but art making is a very fun way to do this. So what I do is, um, you know, before I start, I get relaxed, I may meditate a little bit, I may turn on some relaxation music, turn on maybe like my aromatherapy that I really like. I use rose aromatherapy oils. And um, basically um, you can ask your higher self a question before you start, like if you want an answer to something, or you just ask for guidance for the day or for you know, anything that they want to tell you, what your higher self wants to tell you, okay? So to do this, you do not have to be an artist. It's not something <laughs> that you are going to need, you know, to, to, to know. All you need to know is about art supplies. So my favorite art supply when I'm doing something like this is uh, soft pastels. And I like them because you can blend them and they're very bright colors. I also use pens, like different color pens, and I also have markers. But you know, you can use watercolor, you can use acrylic paint, you can use anything you want, okay? And you can all mix it. You can do mixed media, like on, on a piece of paper. So, so the first thing that I do is I get any color, like anything that calls my attention. So this is the color that's calling me right now so then you just start you know putting the color on the paper however you feel like doing it and then just pick a different color and then um do the same thing anywhere you want to put it is fine and then you're gonna blend it blending is the fun part because it looks so pretty so after I blend it, then, you know, I see that I kind of want a different color, so I add more. I add more. Just blend some more. Um, and so, yeah, you're using your intuition. Um, you can, you know, close your eyes if you want to when you're doing this, or you could just leave them open. But basically, your mind is completely blank because you're so relaxed and that's how you're going to get your messages you know with your mind your self-talk is 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 gone like there's no talking to yourself you're just listening to the music and relaxing so you know something like this doesn't take that long but give yourself like 15 minutes maybe to be able to do this um and then after I feel satisfied with the colors, you know, that I put down, then I get either a marker or I get a pen and I choose any color. And now I'm going to scribble. So I'm going to put my, my pen down, close my eyes, and I'm going to start scribbling. So you can, um, you know, Hold the pen very lightly. Don't hold it too tight because I will let your intuition take control, okay? So after I'm done scribbling, I stop. And then I look at my creation. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to look around for shapes, numbers, anything that pops up. And um. I'm going to, to look at everything, okay? 
and see what see what I see. Mm, very interesting. I see a lot of different things. I see kind of like a landscape. Oh, wow. I see a landscape on that side. So, um, use your intuition. Use your intuition because you may also see like a word or letters. You know, you can look at it for a while until you feel like you know what you want to do or you're getting the messages. Like right now while I'm doing this, like I'm looking at it, my crown chakra is activated. It's like turning because I'm, I'm, getting, <laughs> I'm getting some messages just looking at this. Maybe it's some downloads. That's so cool. Okay, well, what I see right here is, I see like mountains, so I do see like a landscape, oh, but then when I turn it over, I see legs, I see two pairs of legs. Interesting. Oh. Oh, I see a, a like a mom with a baby and some legs. So I'll go with that. So so then after this, you're going to grab another another pen, maybe like a darker color, and you're going to you know, uh, outline what you see. So right here I see I don't know if you guys can see this, but I see like this legs like it's a uh, somebody kneeling so these are the two legs so i see somebody kneeling and and you can you know finish off the drawing like you can add your own your own like drawing and then right here this is what i see it's like a bundle like a like somebody holding something and then right here I see a head bending down like this. That's so interesting. So yeah, you finish off the drawing. So I don't know if you guys can tell, but I drew like kind of like a, it looks like a mom holding a baby. And she's like looking at the baby. So you can draw her face. So I'm gonna draw her smiling. And here's the little tiny baby. Oh, wow. Okay. So this is what I see. So now, so now that I, that I see this, you're going to you know like once you 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 block your your drawing like what came out out of the scribble so now you're going to think about three words that come to mind when you see this when you see the drawing and the scribble so for me what comes to mind is <laughs> i see mother earth so I'm going to write Mother Earth. And I see love. Like she loves that baby. And this is Mother Earth. Um, Mother Earth, love. And I see, oh, a new baby. So I see a new, a new, a, something new. Oh, that's so sweet. So this reminds me of, you know, how the planet is changing and it's becoming a new planet. 
I, this reminds me of that. So new earth. The new earth is is uh, being born. How sweet. All right. So so you know like after you're done with your drawing, your intuitive drawing, then you can make it um um you can like place it like somewhere that you want to see it, you know, like you could hang it on a wall or in your bedroom or um anywhere you want because you will continue to get intuitive messages out of this drawing. Like the more that you look at it, okay? And you can also meditate with this drawing. Like if you just, you know, sit quietly and you look at everything, you may even get more. You may even see more um, shapes, more things in the drawing. So yeah, this is so pretty. Okay, so this is what I have for you today. Um, thanks for watching. And I hope you try it out and let me know if you liked it. But um you know just just have fun with it okay there's no right or wrong obviously you saw what i did there's no right or wrong you're just using your intuition and your guidance your inner guidance is giving you messages so this is basically like channeling so you're channeling information through art okay all right so i'll see you guys later in a different video oh i also wanted to say that um i want to start uh drawing my past lives so i'll post some videos on on those on those uh lives okay because i want you guys to see those lives because um more and more people are going to start remembering who they really are and it's going to be super normal super exciting when people start remembering so i just want to normalize all of this so yeah i'm gonna make some in the future i'm gonna show you guys some of my drawings of my past life memories okay all right then you guys have a nice night or nice day take care bye bye